Hi, I'm Jessica Cottis, and along with Matthew Heinsen, I'm co-curator for the Canberra Symphony Orchestra's Australian mini-series. I'm delighted today to be joined by Deborah Cheatham, who has composed a piece for us called Permit Me. Uh, Deborah, Permit Me, what's, what's the impetus for this, this work of yours? Hi Jess. Well, I'm speaking to you from the unceded lands of the Bunwarang people here. They're part of the Kulin Nation and uh, more generally known as Melbourne these days. Uh, and that word Melbourne in Australia has a particular resonance after 2020 and what we went through during the lockdown. Uh, 2020 was difficult for everyone all across the world. In Australia, we were relatively unaffected, except for Melbourne. We had months and months of hard lockdown. It became the envy of the world in a way because we got down to zero cases and zero deaths. And we're yeah. still at that number, even today as I speak to you. But in the midst of that lockdown period in 2020, I was working on this short piece for Patrick Sullivan's a beautiful cellist from CSO and I'll be honest with you as a composer when we went into we had two lockdowns and the mm. second one was really hard and what made it so hard was in Melbourne we had curfews imposed upon the entire population of Greater yeah. Melbourne so we couldn't go out of our houses after 9 p.m until uh, I think it was five or six in the morning. It was really shocking. It came as an in incredible blow, this, mm. this idea of a curfew. And it was really messing with my compositional flow. Mm. And all I could do was take that experience and turn it into the composition. And for me, along with the curfew, which was really tough, was the idea that if we wanted to go outside a five kilometer radius in Melbourne, we needed a permit. Yeah, when yeah. That, when that was announced, Jess, that really stung because my grandparents as Aboriginal people, they knew curfews and permits, not for weeks or months, but curfews and permits were imposed upon them by the British as punishment simply for being Aboriginal. And they lived with that for decades. Yeah. And even though I knew that, even though I knew that history until I was living a tiny slither of it. I mean, let's face it, I live in a lovely apartment. I'm in this great city. I have access at other times of the day. But even that little touch of what my grandparents went through it really just it rocked me and i had to find a way of expressing that and permit me became that piece it it's so powerful thank you for sharing that with us deborah and um this now is permit me played by the canberra symphony orchestra's principal cellist patrick southers composed by deborah cheatham <laughs> 